hello today march 15 tuesday after the market opened today we had a v-shape recovery on one minute and right now looking at the bigger time frames um i forgot to put up the one hour and 30 minutes instead i have now uh, weekly and uh, daily and four hours and the weeks here so on the bigger time frames like a weekly and daily uh, we still have that down trend on the weekly though we have this level here that the um, price may bounce from here and on the four hours is trying to break this level here so on the delta here i got this level there um, and uh, waiting this uh, price is cross on this here level or is gonna try to come back and try to uh, break this level And right now I am marking the extending this uh, boxes over these uh, uh, V-shape areas on the volume. So these are can act as a resistance areas or after they break, uh, you may try to enter there too. So I am waiting this uh, delta to uh, cross this level here or is it gonna jump, bounce from here? So I'm waiting what's gonna happen and also waiting this one minute bar to close. I wanna see the action, I mean the price action there. So that's, that is good for down, down move. And I'm waiting this uh, delta is under this level here. Um, so I'm kinda thinking to enter a short here and Delta is still trying. Order filled. Enter two positions here. And still Delta is um, trying, but not too fast, which is um, usually not too good sign. Um, I would like to see a uh, faster move after enter and breaking this level here. And delta is slowed down and I don't see the follow-up and I'm trying to move my uh, target up. stop filled it might just stop me out okay so the price went up again of the level and now I'm waiting this if the uh, try to break this level or is gonna come back and test this area here so I will be waiting this bar to close and see how it's going to form okay last 10 seconds and the Delta is still strong Yeah, last few seconds that bar is yeah went went up very high. So I'm waiting this to break this level here, and it just did on the one minute also. And right over here, I have uh, on my one hour chart, I have a level, and also a uh, moving average line at the same spot here. So I'm trying to um, enter a position here to catch that bounce. And I am waiting this one minute to show some weakness and also waiting a delta show some weakness as well. So it's still strong everything. Um, I want to see like a pop and the week 
okay, we see we saw some uh, weak there, and I'm waiting another pop to catch me. Yeah, it didn't. And the delta kind of slowed down a little bit and trying to break this level. Okay, 30 seconds left to close that bar. Yeah, still trying to break this level here on delta. And I want to see this bar to close like a week, like this shape, some, something similar like this. And I will wait another pop to catch me. Okay, nine seconds left. And delta is trying to break that. Okay, so this bar is uh, close okay for me, and I'm waiting another pop now, if it does. Usually it does that on NQ to take the um, stop loss uh, areas here, but this time it didn't. And I see that the delta is uh, Order filled. Some weakness, so I decided to enter. Order filled. And Exit it. Yeah, I just, uh, I think, filled me just one contract. I now wait in this bar to close and also check in this delta what is going to do on this level here, or is it gonna try to go back up to break this level? Okay, Delta is again on the level here. Okay, Delta is still same nothing change on that and wait in this bar to close okay close with a week there it's not a very great or down but I will wait to see what the Delta is going to do here Yeah, the delta is keep slowly going up. The price is still uh, trying to go down. And I see some weakness on this bar here. Uh, three seconds left. And I see some weakness on delta too. I'm kind of thinking maybe enter another short here. Delta is still slow sideways. Yeah, the prices keep moving. Kind of try to catch. Order filled. Oh, that was a fast jump. And look at the delta. After I see that, I just make it break even. Stop filled. Hey, stop me out. Now I will wait this bar to close. Eight seconds left. And it looks like it's gonna close with the week on the bottom. Yep, there is a week there, there's a hammer there. So the delta just broke this level here. And the, the thing is there here, um, looks like a, a hidden divergence is starting here. 
the this level here on the price and this level there but the delta is very high and the when you compare to this level here price is way low lower than the level of the delta so because of that um, i'm waiting this uh, weakness on the delta and try to enter a short position here with two contract order filled i just enter and i'm checking this delta here and if the delta price is going up on this level here i will exit i want to see some down move here and i uh, right here where it is it is fine where this v-shape here there can be a resistance here or a, a bounce back so i'm looking at the delta is uh, slow right now sideways and i want to see break this level okay just broke there yeah it's kind of slow a little bit so i'm kind of getting ready to exit this trade order filled yeah we just did it so 750 for the day and later on the day um I was trying to wait this delta to um, cross this, uh, break this level here, and also break this 50, but it never did. So that was it for me today.